All right, guys, Boy 32 here. Check it out. Real quick video. Have you guys ever heard of this lady named Lauren Boebert? She is a freshman Congress lady from Colorado. Man, let me tell you something. I just read up on her, but she just released this really cool deal letting those guys who uh, <laughs> think they run Congress that uh, she's going to do what she has to do to, in order to protect herself, and that is exercising her Second Amendment right. Now, since 1960, I think it is, that uh, lawmakers have been uh, allowed to carry a firearm into the Capitol. Those are lawmakers. And she is going to do that. And I love that fact. Watch this real quickly. This is the intro. I'm going to put the link to her Facebook page down below with this video. This is cool as it gets. But I'm going to tell you something. This woman, when she speaks, she means business. And those little retards up there called the squad, you better watch your happy ass because this shit's about to get real. Watch this. I'm Lauren Boebert, and I approve this message. Cut. That's a wrap. Hi, I'm Lauren. I'm a newly elected congresswoman from Colorado. Even though I now work in one of the most liberal cities in America, I refuse to give up my rights, especially my Second Amendment right. I will carry my firearm in D.C. and in Congress. This caused outrage from Democrats and the media. Why? It's our job in Congress to defend your rights, including your Second Amendment, and that's exactly what I'm here to do. All right, guys, <laughs> what did y'all think about that? Man, I absolutely love her. We need more people like that, more women like that in Congress. But the whiny-ass little bitches up there have sent letters to Nancy Pelosi. Tell oh my goodness, she wants to carry a gun. Ah! Ladies and gentlemen, that's the shit right there. It annoys me to no end that these individuals who think that, well, I don't need a gun. You don't need one. Why do you need a gun? You must feel really insecure about yourself. No, actually, I feel real secure about myself. So secure that uh, I want to protect myself and my family and those around me by, one, exercising my Second Amendment right and those that are given to me. Now, here's the thing. The chief of police for D.C., because she's wanting to carry it to and from work, well, I guess they've like, well, you know, she's not uh, she's not privy to any special treatment around here. She's going to have to follow the law. Well, from what I understand, she's already gone through all the proper measures and the steps in an effort to do a carry conceal in D.C., which is pretty much just like, oh, I don't know, New York, uh, Maryland, uh, New Jersey, where you has you know basically a act of God in, in an effort to get one of these things. So anyway, I just think it's funny that the, the whiny little bitches up there are screaming and hollering and writing letters in, in an effort to keep this lady from being able to exercise her Second Amendment right. And obviously, she's had enough training. She knows how to handle a firearm. So what are these people scared of? That's the whole thing that frightens it, it, it tears me apart. I, I've actually met a couple of people that lived up in New Jersey and go, oh, guns scare me. I'm like, why? Why do guns scare you so much? Is it the, the violent criminal with a firearm? Is it just a gun? In most cases, what they think of is that if we get rid of guns, criminals just can't have them. Well, anyway, Lauren Boebert, I hope and pray for the best for you and your leadership up there. And I want you to get up there and kick these individuals in the ass. Exercise your right to do what you want. And God bless you because we need more Americans like you in Congress. Man, what a sham these assholes up there who want to keep everybody from exercising their Second Amendment right at their own cost. They don't, they don't care about their safety. All they care about is... Just, I just, you know, guns, it's just so scary. I just, <laughs> and did you hear about Ilhan Omar? I, I, I hate to make a comment on this one, but we are going to make a comment. I'm going to talk about that tomorrow. And we also got a thing on Ohio coming up here pretty soon. I'm enjoying these type of videos. Uh, we do, uh, we are putting the 6.5 Creedmoor uh, Live Free Armory 6.5 Creedmoor together uh, this week. Hopefully get out to the range next week and do some test firing with that thing. Uh, we're going to introduce you to the GLX Apollo from Primary Arms. And I'm going to show you not only how to use the reticle, but you're going to also show you that the turrets are absolutely amazing on that guy. What else we got? That's it. 
Uh, Chief Robert Conti III when asked during a press conference about the newly elected Colorado lawmaker's plan to carry a gun to the Capitol, said he wants to ensure that she is aware of what the laws of the District of Columbia are. Anyway, she's taking care of that whole bit. I just uh, wanted to do something real quick and uh, say thank you. Also, thanks to all the Patreon guys uh, sticking with me through thick and thin on this thing. Um, you guys are awesome. And uh, with that being said, we always end them like this. God bless America. God bless his men, women in uniform, 24-7 for our freedom. Because freedom's not free. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. And God bless Lauren Bobert. Lauren Bobert from Colorado. Oh, yeah. Y'all be good. I am out of here.